What is up guys, my name is Supreme Mayfid and today we're going to be reviewing one of the best budget phones out there, the Motorola G6. But before we start the review, I wanted to make a really fast announcement. Basically, I'm going to be giving a shout out to the first comment of every video from now on, as long as it makes sense and is appropriate. So anyways, let's get into the review. <laughs> Today I will be reviewing the Moto G6 and talking about why it is one of the best budget phones of 2018. So first here are all of the basic specs. It has a 5.7 inch screen that has 424 ppi, which is higher than the new iPhones. It also has a longer aspect ratio of 18 by 9 compared to the average 16 by 9 aspect ratio for a smartphone. Mine has 32 gigabytes of storage plus expandable storage via a micro SD card up to 128 more gigabytes of storage. The battery is a hefty 3000 milliamp hours. I love the battery in this phone, especially coming from the iPhone 6. I generally end the day at about 30%, so it lasts for a long time. It also supports turbo charging. This is by far the best phone battery I have had in a phone. Another cool thing about this phone is that it has USB-C and still even has an audio jack. This phone is glass on all edges, so it is important that you get a good case. I bought a case by Poetic that protects the phone very well, including the phone's face, which most phone cases lacked. This case really complements the phone with its clear back, and it is also really smooth, so it won't catch on your pockets. I took the plastic screen protector off that it came with and stuck a glass screen protector on instead. If you're interested in this case or phone, make sure you check the description out below. This phone has an 8 core Snapdragon 450 processor, which is plenty for a smartphone. The Moto G6 also has 4GB of RAM. If you want to constantly be running PUBG on your smartphone, the Moto G6 may not be the best choice for you, but this phone does run very smoothly. Motorola really tuned this phone to run as smoothly as possible. The cameras on this phone are pretty good. The main 16 megapixel rear camera can shoot 1080p at 60fps with stabilization features. And here's a picture that I took with the Moto G6. Then the front 12 megapixel camera is also pretty decent. It shoots 1080p at 30fps and this picture was taken with the front camera. So overall the cameras are pretty good, but over Snapchat not so much, thanks to Snapchat's developers hating Android users. Anyways, the speaker on this phone is great. It gets loud and has great clarity. I've seen several reviews of people saying that the speaker on this phone was bad, which still does not make any sense to me, because I love the speaker on this phone. This phone also has a fingerprint scanner as well as facial recognition. The fingerprint scanner works really fast and I use it more than the facial recognition. One of my favorite things about Motorola is all of the features and gestures they have added. The one I use the most is shaking your phone to turn on the light. Overall, for $239, this phone is amazing. It is definitely one of the best budget smartphones out there. It looks great and runs way better than my old iPhone 6, and it only cost me a fraction of the price. I would definitely recommend this phone to anybody because it keeps up with today's most popular phones at a fourth or a third of the price. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the review of the Motorola G6. Like always, if you did, make sure you drop a like down below, and if you did not enjoy it, just dislike it. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, make sure you drop a comment down below and if you guys want to purchase this phone or the case or screen protectors make sure you order those through the links in the description that would really help my channel out also if any of you guys are interested in an iphone 7 plus charging case make sure you comment down below because i might be giving away one of those pretty soon anyways i'll see you guys on the next video Reality. it is touching the truth